Hello. Recording. I am here. The menu. Oh, it's my reaction to the menu. Are you ready, boys? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cool. Let, let's go from start to finish, eh? First, I love the design. I love the uh, the creepy face. <laughs> um, appetizers, water and salt. Hmm. I expected that from these two. Uh, I wonder so how much salt the they put in. It's yeah, the good for the brain. A nice palate cleanser. Uh, I think you've got to get the right ratio of salt to water. And that's what and, I'm looking and for. And the salt, it makes you more thirsty than me. It does, it does. Uh, another thing as well, what type of salt will they use? Uh, I prefer myself a bit of sea salt, but you know, they could surprise me. A, a bit of pink Himalayan salt. Sheesh. We know Benny shopped at Waitrose for this, so. Uh, and uh, entrees, we have the Venetian duck ragu with pappardelle, uh, or mystery pasta. I will be having the Venetian duck ragu, because mystery pasta is for vegetarians. <laughs> um, sounds sounds good. Is is ragu? I thought ragu was more bolognese. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Then. My bad. Ask that chef, wasn't it? Uh, he'll know more about this dish than I am. Um, I've never cooked duck before. Um, I mean, I've been watching them cook. It, it, it looks reasonable. Uh, and how do you feel about it? It smells good. It was, they put the crisp side down as well. So, uh, crisp skin side down so it gets nice and crispy. So it sounds good. Um, and barbarelle, waitrose, egg barbarelle, so that would be nice. For desserts. Ice cream or ice cream. Uh, buy your own from Nisa. Uh, oh, and that's it. You're gonna read the menu. Read it right, mate. Uh, ice cream or ice cream? Are we saying? Ice cream. And for drinks, it's uh, water or wine. Um, well, I'm looking forward to this. Uh, it sounds like it's gonna be amazing. Uh, what do I expect from the boys? Do I expect the boys to make a good meal? Uh, I think they, I think they will. If I'm, yeah, uh, I'm not sure Willie's gonna do anything. To be honest, I think it's all gonna be Benny. Uh, so what was that? Um, I don't need to slam the Willie's. Uh, but I'm, I'm looking forward to it. All right, chill there. It's still pretty good. I know it's had to use a little carpet. Yeah, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> How do I do this? Yeah. Gotta get the good lights in. Mm. Oh, yeah, oh, you like yeah, it down there, do you? Is it Benny? Yeah, we're staying in. Yeah. It's Benny's oh, way. This is the right Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Smell that. Yeah, catch it. I do like wood now. What's happened to the fruit pastels? I made them then. Oh, okay. Oh, I found what? <laughs> what am I? So, um, uh, William and Benny food review. Uh, it's out of ten, right? The food. Yeah. The food itself. Well, we'll start with the appetizer. Uh, Nought and the salt. Um, I was very impressed by the quality of salt. It was, I've got it, ah, uh, Benny put it away. Um, some fancy sea salt. It tasted very good. I had a little, <coughs> um, little edge to it. And I was a bit curious as to see how much salt to water they put in at first. But they left that up to the guests, which you could see as lazy, but also, um, could see that as being, catering to all likes. Uh, so the appetizer was good. The main meal, the Venetian duck ragu, you know, with parvadelle, um, it was very nice. Um, apart from the explosive incident I had last night after having it, I was thoroughly impressed. Any comments? Smelled amazing. I would say it smelled slightly better than it tasted. It smelled amazing when I was cooking there, and I tasted it, and it's, it was very good, but it wasn't as amazing as the smell. Um, 
but there was plenty of it, which is always a a, a nice welcome. Um, a vegetarian option. Um, a vegetarian option, um, which sounded good. Uh, I didn't try it, so I can't rate that. But Romney polished it all off. <laughs> Which is a good sign. But she'll mention it in her review. <laughs> I think it's just me. <laughs> um, shit. Let me, let me get a photo up. You know. Um, <laughs> so this was what it looked like. Um, in terms of presentation, well, we served it ourselves, which felt a little bit cheap. Um, I actually asked, would that be something for you, or would you do it yourself? I mm, most people say, mm. do it themselves. I don't know. The service was very shabby as well, very shabbily dressed waiter. He was running around, frolicking. Um, <laughs> waiter slash ninja. <laughs> slash everything, he was stuffing his face with pasta. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> the, the chef was eating pasta in front of our faces before serving the guests. <laughs> then claimed it fell in his mouth. On two occasions. Um, I, I, I was a big fan of the menu. Um, that ain't gonna focus, is it? Oh, it has kind of, uh, but it's in reverse. Sorry about that. Um, the food, um, the main was very good. And then dessert, ice cream by your own from Nisa. Um, not ice cream. Well, Went to Nisa, at first didn't think there was any ice cream, thoroughly disappointed. Then I was called over and there we found the £3.75 Tony's um, Ben and Jerry's, um, which made my night. Uh, unfortunately, part of this trip I broke my keycard. So, the ice cream, I went from having a free meal to spending £10.75. <laughs> long day. Um, but on a positive note, the ice cream was good. Uh, and for drinks, water and wine. Uh, the water was adequate. Um, in terms of entertainment, we were told the entertainment was the experience. Just come on. I mean, it was, it was a good experience. I thought it was good entertainment. <laughs> Not, not much effort went into it. Um, I'm gonna rate the night as a whole. I'm gonna rate it a 7.5 out of 10. It's a good score. It's a good score. Um, it was a fun night. The food was very good. Um, apart from the diarrhea and nothing else, I can't blame them for anything else. Um, and so that's about it. Although, Willie and Benny. <laughs>